morning everyone i am dr vijay mandari associate professor csc department so let's start the this topic data structures in python so today i will teach you data structures in python what are the data types what are the structure of files tables right so now move to next slide definition so data structures is a way of organizing data so that it can be accessed more efficiently depending upon the situation data structures are fundamentals of any programming languages around which a program is built python helps to learn the fundamental of these data structures in a simpler way as compared to other programming languages like c++ java perl cobol right so it is just a way of organizing data so that it can be accessed more efficiently depending upon so here i will uh, we will uh, be doing some practical session so you will be understanding that so i will teach you today is in uh, data structures first as list right so python lists are just like the arrays declared in other languages which is ordered collection of data it is very flexible as the items and a list do not need to be of same type so if we see here the implementation of python list is similar to vectors in c++ or array list in java costly operation is inserting or deleting the elements from the beginning of the list as well uh, elements are needed to be shifted secondly insertion and deletion of the end of the list and also become costly in the case where the pre allocated memory becomes full so where we will see the implementation of python list in uh, in this session right for example creating python so here i am giving a variable where i am storing all the elements in the form of array so 1 comma 2 Three and uh, GFG is a character which is imported by the uh, uh, commas inverted commas. GFG is a string can be treated as so Python will uh, print all the list. So here, uh, here you can see in this printed right. If you check the type of uh, the list, so it will give you the. Uh, Uh, the result of the bound right so list element can be accessed by the assigned index in python uh, starting index uh, of the list sequence is zero and the ending index is, is n elements are there and minus 1 so here you can see can be started as zero and last element in minus 1 so starting point will be this and ending point will be this if you see uh, if you uh, if you want to access last elements you can just uh, use minus 1 right so the index will be starting from minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 minus 4 minus 5 minus 6 minus 7 minus 8 and up to minus 12 so if you want to reverse the list you can perform very easily here you have to do some minus uh, Uh, list of minus one, and it will be the results. So here, default the beginning of the sequence, slicing from here till beginning, reverse it by using these operations. You can perform double uh, colon minus one. So this kind of the operations you can perform very easily. And now. i will show you uh, the some uh, examples of uh, the 
first uh, uh, open the terminal. There we can see the some operations. I will uh, clear. Uh, the new file. Uh, some list you can uh, in the packet one comma two is it then now if you want to print list one list it will give you just the output of this list. Now List of we want to access first element, so it will give you one. If you want to um, last element, is if you want to slice the uh, the uh, element. So here you can zero. So here, what is this? This is a start, stop, and step. So here. You can see zero to one, so it will give you one and uh, step so one, right? If you want to like uh, six, this will give me this figure. So how it uh, works? We have seen here. What are the data structure in Python? Different kind of uh, data types like integer, row, byte array, position sets, list, tuples, dictionaries. Okay, so we will discuss in next lecture, dictionary, right? So that's for today. You can perform various operations, some practicals, and so on on that. If you have doubts, uh, put your queries. Thank you.